Hi and welcome back. It's summertime again and we are going to present another fresh idea on how to withstand even the most demanding heat waves with the use of available smart home solutions. As you probably know, for some time now, Fibaro has officially been a part of NICE Group, one of the largest manufacturers of integrated solutions for entrance gates, garage doors automation, sun protection systems and home security. This means more products, features and also communication protocols that work together as a part of our smart ecosystem. And this episode will be an example of the new wider product portfolio. Today I would like to say a few words about the new thermostats and the one responsible for air conditioning control in particular. Here we have Klima control. First, however, I would like to tell you about the very idea of Z-Wave thermostats. Thermostats are a separate class of devices, and when you add such a device to our system or other Z-Wave gateway of a third-party manufacturer, it will be immediately recognized as a thermostat, meaning a device that can control the climate. Thermostats operate in three possible modes. They can, for example, only heat, like our smart thermostatic head, they can only cool, or they can operate in auto mode, meaning they can both heat and cool within a given temperature range. For a thermostat to work with the auto mode, which is available in our climate panel, the operated device, and in this case that's an air conditioner, it simply needs to support this mode. Klima control is a thermostat that works with infrared air conditioners, meaning we have a remote control that we must point at the air conditioner to turn it on. This is a one-way protocol, so we can send commands to the air conditioner, but we do not receive information on the state of the air conditioner. We can easily install the thermostats ourselves, as it only needs to be hanged on the wall or placed freely on the desk. You can power it through the USB-C port, available here, or the built-in battery to control the air conditioner without interfering with the air conditioner casing. On the front part we have a nice display that shows the temperature and all the available settings. A single tap will present the current temperature of the room and click one more time also the humidity. Yes, the product has a built-in humidity sensor, which is a great addition on its own, but could also be included as a trigger in scenes. In order to add the thermostat to your smart home system, all you need to do is to begin the inclusion process in your gateway, then power your device, turn it on by pressing the central power button, now press and hold down simultaneously up and down arrows. At this point, after some time, the device will enter the inclusion mode. The entire process will begin and you also need to confirm it by pressing the power button once again. Now for the device to work properly and control air conditioners, you must also configure it with your home air conditioner. To do that, you will need to install the IR thermostat app on your phone and follow the instructions provided by the app. The process itself is very intuitive and takes about one minute to complete. The best way to manage temperature is obviously to take advantage of the climate panel offered in the browser user interface of the gateway. You can use it to easily schedule temperature according to individual needs of all the users. You can select the proper mode, schedule temperature set points for the entire day and nighttime across the week. If for any reason you need to manually adjust the temperature in any of the areas of your house, you can do that through the UB Home app and override the schedule for a given period. Here's an interesting tip for those who would like to use Klima Control for more than just managing air conditioning. Why not use it to control underfloor heating as well? To achieve this, we need to create associations between the thermostat and an on-off smart device, such as on-off control. For those unfamiliar with the term, association refers to the ability to send control commands between Z-Wave network devices without the involvement of the main controller. This scenario will work in general for every thermostat that you include to the system 
and it's a great solution when you lack proper wires in the installation. To find out more about associations and how to set them properly, I highly recommend that you read one of our articles from our knowledge base. The link is provided in the description. As mentioned before, we also have additional thermostats to extend the offer. These are warm control, used for managing water heating valves according to the preferred time and temperature, and also fan control. It's an innovative device designed to measure and manage the internal temperature for convector heaters, available in two versions, for two and also four pipe convector heaters. I'm sure that we will cover them in details when the heating season starts. That's all for now, hope you enjoyed the video. Please let us know what you think, subscribe and stay tuned for the next episode. See you next time!